Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon X. Okie dokie, let's get this show on the road. Stop it. I'm just everywhere. Let's go here. We're gonna be the toughest twins in the world. And she just repeated what her sister said. Back this up a little bit. There we go. Dragon pulse? No. It's okay. We're still going to be the toughest twins in the world. I feel kind of bad for them. For beating them now. This way? I uh, guess not. Wait. There's something over here. Well, I guess it's over there. This way? Hmm. Well, looks like I found the Pokemon Village. Wait! You know what this place is? Welcome to the Pokemon Village. This place is a secret, you know? Most of the Pokemon here are runaways, escaped from bad people who did awful things to them. It's a shame. It's a shame how many heartless trainers who can't bother to care for their Pokemon are out there. Some of these Pokemon, though, some of them are just too strong and found they didn't really have a place in the outside world. So they came here. Hmm, I see. Your Pokemon sure seem to think highly of you. You've got some, you've had some good times together, haven't you? Hey, you all can come out now. This one's all right. 
Sometimes I get worried and come here to check on everyone. Oh, excuse my manners. We haven't even had a proper introduction yet. The name's Wolfric. I'm usually over at the gym in Snowbell City, since I'm the gym leader after all. Let me guess. You want to challenge me? Yep. I thought so. Sorry to inconvenience you like this. I'll be waiting for you back at the gym then. Before you come by, I think it would do you good to spend some time with the Pokemon here. Okie dokie, so there... That was Wolfric, the leader of Snowbell Gym. Now, if you'll excuse me, I will be right back. Okay, I didn't get everything, but... At least we got Wolfric back in the gym, right? Let's just go in. They call me the Queen of the Ice Ring. Is it? Colder than cold, faster than fast. Okay. So we gotta move these. Freeze right there! Deli bird, you know you're just begging to lose. in my heart solid.
I like to cool down and clear my head with a refreshing chilled dessert. Here, let me give you a taste. And by chilled dessert, you mean Pokemon battle? I could really go for a nice cold sherbet right about now. Being able to keep your cool no matter the situation is a trademark of the truly, truly powerful law. That's a big boy! And it is me! <laughs> Not sure if that was intended. You've got my blood boiling now. I think this ice is gonna melt. Alright, just uh, give me a few seconds and I will figure out the puzzle. So I'll be right back. Alright, I got the pink one, the blue one, and the yellow one figured out. Okay, I think I got the green one just now. And here we are at the gym leader! Let's see my progress. And talk to him. Oh, I got I had to get closer. <laughs> you know what? Ice is both extremely hard and terribly fragile at the same time. You know what that means? Depending on which Pokemon you choose and what moves they use, I could be your most challenging opponent yet. Or I could be a total pushover. But that's alright. That's how it should be. Now, anyway, enough of my rambling. Let's get the show on the road. And he smacks his belly. What the hell, Wolfric? Oh look, it's Obama Snow! <laughs> I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. Ow. Have a look. Ice is not very good defensively.
outstanding. I'm tough as an iceberg, but you smashed me through and through. All I did was breathe fire. Impressive. Your Pokemon fought with great courage. I can tell that you've trained your Pokemon well. And here's the final badge. The Iceberg Badge. When you have right there... What you have right there is called the Iceberg Badge. As long as you have that, any and all of your Pokemon will surely look up to you and do their absolute best in battle. Let me give you this, too. Ice Beam! <laughs> you know what that is? It's Ice Beam. This move has an accuracy of 100%. Not only that, but every once in a while it will freeze the target it hits, too. I learned... I hope you learned a valuable lesson today. Being rigid is... Being rigid can make you tough, but it will also render you fragile. You're better off being flexible. Flexible, well, you know what I mean? Some people are fluid like water and can adapt to their environment without changing what's important on the inside. Not me, though. I guess I'm too stubborn. Maybe that's why I love ice types. Okay. Maybe the smooth sailing. I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> That's the future champ I know and love. Looks like he triumphed our old chip. Looks like he trumped our old gym leader. It's never a bad thing to test the limits of your strength. Am I right, or am I right? And since you're such a star, I guess that means you're off to the Pokemon League. You know what? You have all the, you have all the gym badges now, so there's really only one thing left to do. It's time you headed off to the Pokemon League. Listen up now. Trust in your Pokemon, and there's no limit to what you can achieve. Alright, so... We can move on to the Pokemon League now! Uh, but where the crap is the gate? Oh, it's there. Duh. I've been with my Pokemon partner since the very beginning of my journey. So have I. Well, that was one reason why I wanted to switch. Oh my god! It's a giant rock crab. 
Well, I'd say that's more like a rock lobster. My partners have been at my side for every defeat. Uh, I'll be right back. Alright, I think we got time for at least one more battle. So, let's go. A strong Pokemon and a strong trainer come together to form a strong team. It's that simple. Once you've memorized all the Pokemon moves and abilities, victory just comes naturally. Uh, wow. I picked a bad team for this. Maybe not. Abracadabra! Hocus Pocus! And with that victory, I will... catch you guys in the next part, okay? Oh, here's a guard spec. Have a great day, everybody, and I will see you all next time for more Pokemon X. Bye-bye!